This is an instructional video on how the valving system works on a three compartment waste corp honey wagon system. First we're going to start off with the butt sucker diaphragm pump. This is the pump you're going to be using for pumping out all the sludges and any muddy substance. Right now the valving system is, is set up so that you can pump from a location and dump into the large tank. And you can tell that by the directional arrow. This is your suction side so the, the flow path is coming in going through the pump and on the discharge side you can see the valve is directed towards the large tank and it's going to discharge through that two inch line up to the uh, large tank in this case it's a thousand gallon system now when you want to drain that tank you have two options the first option is at the rear of the tank there is a ball valve that you can do a gravity feed drain the second option is to pump out with the pump and to do that is very simply done. You'd put the, the dust cover back on the, the suction point here. So now we want to drain the tank with this pump. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to turn this valve. So now this suction hose is sucking the fluid from this tank going through the pump. And then you would divert the valve and instead of pumping that direction, we're now pumping out. You would obviously connect the discharge hose to that. You pump it out. And it's that simple. There is a safety, secondary safety ball valve as well. If something happened to the tank or you want to isolate the tank, there is a two inch ball valve here that you can shut off to shut the system down from that main, from that main tank. Okay, so let's move on to the the water tank and the and the chemical tank okay so right now the you're going to obviously turn on this small trash flow centrifugal pump uh, so right now we're going to set up to pump from the fresh water tank okay so basically you start the engine uh, the liquid would come in through this line into the pump and then discharge to to this um, this reel hose reel where you can spray and do any uh, sanitation that you need to be done. Once you're finished with that, you can move on to the pressure washer, which is designed to be used with the with the chemical uh, liquid. Now, for the pressure washer to work correctly, it needs it needs head pressure to develop, so it can it can create some pressure in the tank here. So, when, with the engine running. We're now going to divert the discharge line. We're going to divert it this way. So now it's no, no longer going to the reel. It's all the pressure is going to the pressure washer itself. And there's also a, a valve here, which you're going to change direction. So this is the suction side. So it's no longer sucking from the water tank. It's now sucking from the uh, chemical tank. And then at that point, you can turn on the engine or the pressure washer and you can pressure wash whatever you need to. Uh, the pressure washer has a mul multiple tips. You can see here, there's, a, there's five different uh, tips that you can use uh, for different applications. And as well as, uh, same as the, the large tank, you do have isolation valves for the chemical tank and the uh, fresh water tank if you do want to isolate those for any reason. Okay, if there's any questions, uh, please contact us and we can assist you any, with any other further questions you have. Thanks.